Hello bloggers, not long to go now till you see the first episode of the third series of Being Human. So as a little treat, I'm going to take you on a little tour of our new house. What does that say? Do not use the door. But uh, I'm a rebel, so we are going to use the door. Come in. Okay, through this front door. This is our new living room, come dining room, with our own Hawaiian Tropic bar. As you can see, plenty of alcohol to keep us occupied. And some music. Oh, I can't find it, but there's a tape here of um, Robson Green, when he used to be a singer. So we're hoping to get that into one of the shots at some point. Anyway, this is the bar that used to be, as you can see, it used to be a B&B. &B. So it's nice and big, and you'll see that when we show you the sets. Come on through this way. Hello. Now, I would show you the kitchen, but uh, I think that's lovely James up there is doing something with, with the lights. But if you take a wee peek, there's James there. Wave to James. Hi. I feel like Davina McCall, stroke and a rice. This is the kitchen. It's getting a bit loud here because we've got a fan on because it gets so hot in here. We've been cooking some ratatouille and there's a nice uh, mixed salad on the table. We don't actually get to eat any of that because this is episode five where things get hectic. So if you come around this way, we'll show you upstairs. Now we're going upstairs to the first floor, if you'd like to follow me. And we'll see that it leads to nowhere. The trickery involved. I'll show you where the real bedrooms are. Our cameraman's walking backwards. I'm not sure how safe this is. You're all right, you're all right, you're all right. Last one. There you go. Oh, stuff coming through. See, always working, always working. The first set I can see here, this is the attic, where uh, Mitchell comes to quite a lot to brood because he's good at brooding. Can you squeeze through here? Ta-da! This is the attic. And naturally, with an attic, it's where you keep all your old rubbish. Filthy dog there. Post office games, an old bed. What do you call that? Water? Jug and water for, for the washing, because they didn't have power showers back then. It's an old house. Andrew Purcell, our designer, has done a wonderful job on these sets. They're absolutely huge and just brilliant, really. Let's try some more. And a drum kit, randomly enough. Oh. You'd think I'd know my way around by now, wouldn't you? They usually have an AD with me, so we don't get lost. Oh, uh, no. Oh, dead end. <laughs> Health and safety. This is why I didn't get the uh, Big Brother job. All the uh, fake backdrops, as you can see. Fake backdrop of Barry. I know where we are now. We're all very uh, health and safety conscious here. They let us know when there's real glass on set, because usually if there is glass, it's sugar glass. You can eat it if you're hungry. Right, let's go in here. Behind this door is where the magic happens for Nina and George. Number four. Ta-da! Come in, welcome to the boudoir. It's a nice kind of chintzy uh, fabric for the bedspread. Something that your grandmother might have. Nice wardrobe, as you can see, if we turn the key, it's like Narnia. Nothing there. It's so the cameras come in and get nice and tight um, if we're doing a scene in the bed. Nina's dressing gown, George's dressing gown, both as stylish as each other. Straight ahead we have, I think there's someone in there. This is Danny the prop man. Hi Danny. How you doing, all right? I'm fine, thanks, how are yeah, you? Fantastic, as always. What have I ever seen you, of course, yeah. Bless them. So this is Annie's room, as you can see, lovely little ornaments. And because it's Annie, because Danny's so clever, there's a teapot. Because she likes to, uh, you know, make tea all the time. Behind number three, we have Mitchell's room. Where we have Rachel from the art department, taking a well-deserved break. Lying in Mitchell's room. Clearly, Rachel loves a bit of Mitchell. Who doesn't? It's true. This is his gorgeous room, all blue and stuff. Don't worry, we're, we're not, we're not, I'm doing a tour, we won't disturb you. But that is our lovely Rachel. That's number three. There's a bathroom. There is a bathroom and there's a guest room. Now in here, nice pale blues, pale pinks, pale turquoises and pale yellows. Hot. It's a little bit grubby, you could do with um, a bit of a clean, actually. I'll probably end up doing that. And across the hall, we have the guest room. As you can see, in between lunch, people just find a bed. This is Matt Pointer, our focus puller. Matt, this is the BBC blog people that just come to say hello. He's in the guest room, because he's a guest. 
obviously. And yet again, here's a wardrobe that actually isn't a wardrobe come through. These are the monitors that the directors stay at while we're filming, point out all our bad mistakes and stuff. And that's about it. So I hope you've enjoyed your little tour. I don't think there's anything else. Um, the sets are huge, they're fantastic. And we can't wait for you to see the show and really, really hope you enjoy it. I think you will.